Early Birds and Night Owls. My name is Nox, aka Mako, and welcome back to City Skylines Mass Transit. Today we're going to work on our traffic situations and maybe also adding in another mode of transportation. Why? Because we have this river here and I think if we can maybe clear out some people actually traveling maybe outside of the city to maybe shop or something like that via some other mode of transportation, maybe that's going to help us out with traffic. I know it's probably not the most pressing issue, but if we can, you know, do that, it might help. I don't know if it's going to help, but that's just a thought. Also, as soon as we unlock this one, we'll be able to put our, um, what are they called? Are they fairies? I think they're fairies, right? Are you a fairy? Cargo Harbor, Harbor, Ferry Depot, yes. Fairy, we could probably put another fairy right up in here, and that should be able to then transport people over here to this area where we might have some good stuff happening. It looks like we're needing water there. It's not connected. What? It should be connected. I don't know why it's not connected. There we go. And it looks like we're having some thievery issues. That should not be the case. Do we have police there? Oosh. We don't have police there. I guess we're going to have to get one just because it's very obvious that we're having some issues there. So there we go. We now have police and I suppose we should probably get maybe a firehouse because obviously we're going to have some issues here. So let's go ahead and drop a firehouse right across the street there. And maybe this is going to be good. Maybe they're going to be all upgrading now and everything like that. I don't know. I just I really don't like the roads being so thin like that. It just doesn't feel safe for some reason. I don't know. All right. So over here, let's see. We have some... Stop signs. Okay, stop sign should work. Stop sign should be okay. Even though this looks super dangerous already. I like how people are actually parking here. That makes no sense to me, but sure. Okay, they can do whatever they want. That means they're taking the bus, and that's probably better for us, huh? Obviously, we're having some kinds of issues here with... Ah, we have lights here. I mean, I, I, I'm okay with lights on the expressway, just because expressways sometimes do have lights, and... You know, or most of the time do have lights, I should say. So to me, that's kind of okay. It might be needed, especially here. Maybe not so much here because it seems like we shouldn't really be yielding to too much traffic. So we should maybe get rid of that. So let's see. We're going to go ahead and get rid of this right to there. And we can add stop signs, but it seems like... Oh my gosh. That was a little bit dangerous, but I think this is okay. I think this is okay. So for the most part, we only have... Oh, we only have one stoplight there? I guess... Wait. Do we have more? Did I just not see there or something there? Also, it looks like the speed here is a little bit slow. I wonder if we can make it a little bit faster. I don't think so. We might have to change our speed some other way. What? What is this? Maybe a car was going through? I don't know. We might have to change our speed some other way. What's happening here? Let's see. We party all night long. Oh, so people are actually enjoying the leisure area. And it looks like only a few businesses here are having some kinds of issues, which I'm kind of okay with them not having, you know... Not everybody will be able to visit every place here. We have a lot of commercial, no doubt about that. There is a dead person there, which is also not good because I would prefer that we don't have so many dead people all over the place. So it looks like we're basically good. Just two dead people. That's kind of okay. Over here we have none. Good. And over here it's looking pretty nice. We might be able to... Why do we have... Oh. For a second, it looked like we had a lot of demand for industry, but we very clearly still have a lot of industrial area open. Also, some of these are not really getting workers, so we might need to actually expand on our... Uh, oh, never mind. There's still actually areas open for people to build their homes, so we don't exactly need to expand. I will, however, do a little bit of expansion just so we can maybe get some more homes somewhere in here. So let's see. We're going to go ahead and maybe take a uh, street right through here, since we can. And uh, they're going to be small houses, but that's okay with me. And let's see, we're trying to keep away from these guys, but it seems like these are in the way of that, and they're kind of okay. So what we want to do instead is probably bring some streets right down through here. I do want to curve these, actually, now I'm looking at it. I want to curve these, something like... The Ooh, we can connect this over here. Do we want to make more connections? We could probably make the connection right there, because there's already one there. So I'm okay with that. And let's see, we're going to go ahead and maybe make some more streets up through here. A little bit curvy. Hmm. Maybe not there. Maybe not there at all. Let's go ahead and do something like, oh boy, something like this? Sure, I guess. Whatever works, that's not super weird. I guess the street over here can actually exist. Oh, that got rid of a business there. You know what? I'm okay with that. I am okay with that. And let's see, can we fit one more street right up in here? It's going to get rid of some homes, but that's okay with me just because we're going to be able to add a lot more. 
So this should maybe be enough residential for the time being. Looks like we obviously need some more commercial. So I might get that like closer to these guys, like commercial at the end of the streets though. Seems weird, so I might just not do that. I don't know, I'll add a few there. That's not gonna be a problem. Actually, I should probably just get rid of that one there and get that one there and just make all of that commercial. So that should be good for our demands here. Let's see, we add another street um, right here. So that should all... Cook Street, nice. It's a very, very small street, unfortunately. And all this can be residential just because it's like on a weird side street that's not really connected anywhere. All right, so commercial. We're going to actually, that has to stay residential just because it's on a random side street there. And let's just turn all of this to exactly what we need it to be. There we go. So that should be just about everything. If I miss something, I apologize. Um, to make things not as bad, actually, I will make some throughways here. Just because I don't want people to have to drive all the way through and be like, oh, well, I'm, I guess I'm going to cause extra traffic, which is what we don't want. So let's see, there's one, and I suppose we can probably add another one somewhere around here. Let's connect it, like, over here, connect it, like, over here. Sure, and there. Okay, it works for me. Things are a little bit wonky looking, but you know what? If it works, it works. That's usually my motto here. So let's go ahead and line that up with some more residential area there. And is that everything? Did we actually capture everything? Nope, that would be a no. We have some right there, and... I mean, you know, they're going to be small houses, but I'm okay with that. I'm definitely okay with small houses, just because they still work, okay? They still work, and that should be good there. If not, you know what? It's okay that we missed a spot. I'm, I have no issues with that. Is this area all covered with water? It is, and do we have enough electricity? We do. Wow, we seem to be pretty good, although, yeah, you know what? We have to wait for them to build out. We do have this big, wide area here where we can probably connect the street through here and there. So I might just do that just to maybe get something going on here. So let's see, we're going to have to destroy a poor house here, which I'm usually not okay with, but I'm going to do it anyway just because. There we go. And, oh, that was two houses. My bad. My bad. So, of course, we're going to get some more commercial up in here. And since this is essentially a main road, I'm going to just line this up with commercial instead. So let's go ahead and do that. And that should be good. We're going to have, you know, little corner stores and whatnot here. So that should be good. And, I mean, we have some more room here, but I'm just not going to do anything there. We had somebody leave. That's not good. That's not good at all. Let's see. Do we have enough services? There's not enough services to cover the inside, at least for health. So I'm going to go ahead and put a clinic, let's see, right up in the corner here. Because that basically covers everything. Good. As for the fire, we are mostly covered here. So I'm going to just skip. Police, not so much. Where's the closest station? That one there. Are you kidding me? That was so far out. I guess we could probably put it in this... Ooh, maybe not there. Maybe not there. Where are we going to put this guy? Because I don't want to take it... Oh, okay, there. Sure. I'm okay with that. It makes people happy. So let's see. Do we need any parks? We desperately... Oh my gosh, do we need parks? But the thing is that this area is a little bit weird with placing the... Oh! We're going to take that back. It looks like we can actually fit something there. Maybe not that big. Maybe a little bit smaller. We're going to have to destroy something just to get this guy in. I think I'm okay with that just because it's going to be nice and fit in here. You know, it's going to make people happy and it's going to fit in here quite nicely. Unless we have something smaller. It seems like we don't. <laughs> it really seems like we don't. Are any of these guys going to fit? I mean, it seems like a weird thing to add a Paradox Plaza of all things. We have a Plaza Picnic with Tables. Plaza with picnic tables, I mean, plaza picnic? What, what is a plaza picnic exactly? I don't know, you guys. I don't know. And this theme park is always up for grabs, but it just seems, again, very weird to have here. None of those work, so I guess we're going to go for maybe this guy here? No, it's a little bit big. This this one here. Or this one. No, that's not the right one. Is it this one? Aha, there we go. So what's the difference? Dog park. Will these people keep animals? Will these people actually keep pets? You know, I'm going to drop that there in case they do keep pets. And it seems like we need something out here. So I'm going to just go for maybe a regular park slope. Too steep for this one. Are you kidding me? It works for this one, but not the other one. Fine. Another dog park right there. I mean, you know, if it's a big city, it makes sense to have a few dog parks. And can we actually fit a bigger park somewhere up in here? It seems like we just don't have enough room, unfortunately. Slope is also too steep in most of these places so that's not gonna work unless we delete a house apparently that's uh, also not gonna work hmm i don't like the way this is looking i guess we could probably just use oosh, a main road it's gonna cover some of these houses which is not all of them so i kind of want this out here yeah you know what a park right next to the clinic makes sense i've seen that happen before it's gonna work it's gonna be good for us 
Okay, and of course we have this area over here that basically has nothing. So let's go ahead and give them something to play with. Eesh, we're gonna have to delete a house, because clearly there's no room for this anywhere else. I guess that's okay if, you know, it's gonna make people happy. That's just fine. Let's not make it on the main road, though. Can we actually just take over one house? I would like to just take over one house, just so that we can maybe keep people happy. It looks like that's not gonna happen. There's a bunch of tiny houses here. Can I get rid of them? Sure, I can get rid of them. All right, so there we go. Hopefully, it's gonna make some people here happy. And we won't have to build any more of these guys anytime soon? Maybe? I don't know. Looks like these guys are wholly unhappy. Maybe they want some kind of leisure over here, which... Eesh, fair enough. I mean, vertical farms kind of make sense over here. This is, you know, a farming area, so... Let's see, there are businesses there. It's just, um... Can't exactly see them. Oh, can we fit it in the corner here? We can fit it in this corner. However, that was our connection to the highway. So we're gonna have to move that if we build that there, which I'm kind of sort of not okay with. Right here? And destroy this? I also don't like that at all. So we might have to make, you know, a regular street for it. Like, just extend the street. We can do that. We can definitely do that. Let's just extend the street out to here. Sure, sure. And we are going to go ahead and add in a... Wait. Mm, no, I think, you know, this makes some sense here because this area is for farms. So I guess, yeah, we're going to add two. Sure, what the heck, why not? And we can fill in that area with something else that we need if uh, we deem it necessary. This looks way out of place, but you know what? I think it's okay because we kind of need to start upgrading this area a little bit. Also, these buildings are missing some raw materials, so that means we don't exactly have enough connections here. Ah, aha, that could be a problem. That means we might have to expand our streets here because there are so many cars trying to leave. Namely, just this one here. You, you might have to get rid of something. Oh my gosh, I did not ever expect this area to be as buzzing as it is. Look at how busy this is. This is insanity. All right, so we're going to have to get rid of some businesses here. I am so sorry, businesses. We have to replace you with something that's a little bit better, apparently. And let's just refill this guy in just to make sure that we get some pretty big businesses coming in here. Because I really like those big farms. They look kind of cool. They have pigs and everything, and I just I like them. So bigger roads definitely going to help out here, at least in this area here. Because clearly this is our main intersection, which... Not so sure cool, but I guess it works. And it looks like we are either upgrading or rebuilding. Not so sure what's happening there. Right now we have a little bit of industrial demand, which I guess makes sense because these are actually taken up. I thought they weren't, but they are. So we're going to have to figure out where to go with more industrial. Maybe over here we do have some more street available to us. So let's see, we can probably do... Grab this, bring it out here, curve it up into here... And ta-da! Suddenly we can get a few more farms, which I guess is kind of what we want in here, so sure. Let's go ahead and just line that up with some more industrial so we can get these guys filled in nicely. There we go. Alright, so we're trying to grow, even though <laughs> clearly still need a lot of workers. I don't know what the game's trying to tell me. Like, you know what? Build more industrial. Oh, but wait. You don't have enough workers. Also, the garbage has piled up over here. It seems like we are not actually delivering things as soon as we need to because we are having traffic. So let's see exactly where this traffic is, although I can see exactly where it is. So I'm just going to go ahead and ignore that first. So let's see, there's no traffic in this area anymore. We cleared that up after getting rid of that one little on-ramp there. This right here is a nightmare and a half because we're getting a lot of people trying to come through here. No doubt about that. They're just like trying to get through here to go around because there's no other way to get on here. We deleted that after it was causing way too many issues. And so now this is causing an issue, which is pretty bad because clearly we're not getting things delivered where we need them to be. And that's the reason kind of why I started building this park, because excuse me, this area, because this these being all the way over here was just not working for us. Although now it's probably going to work for us. These areas over here are a little bit busy, but they're not that busy. This area, I mean, this is always going to be a pretty busy road, so I'm kind of okay with that one that, like that. This here, hmm. Hmm, I guess it's okay. It's not as bad as it was. Clearly, there's a little bit of stop-up, actually. So we're going to have to try to figure out where these are going. Let's see, Nylons Galore. Okay, so you're, you're delivering product. You're driving to work. Oh, maybe we shouldn't. Where exactly do you live? here and you're driving to work do we not have a bus available for you i'm pretty sure we have a bus available for you that can take you all the way over there but you're just like mm, nah so you know what i'm gonna do i am actually going to go ahead and 
edit our, uh, let's see, metro, yes, we need to add an extra stop. Because clearly, they're trying to drive over here, and that is not helping us at all. It looks like we have actually a good area right here. Somebody deleted, or we never actually filled it in. Whatever it is, I'm going to go ahead and fill this guy in with our metro. Eh, sure, right there. So, let's see, we're going to have to connect this with this over here, which means we're actually going to have to expand a little bit our, um, our line. We're going to have to change our line, actually. So we're going to take this from, let's see, here. Mm -hmm. We're going to go, let's see, we're going to go through there. We're going to maybe try to skip that, although, ooh, that's actually our stop. We have to go there. <laughs> Never mind. I was like, let's try to skip it. It's, you know, not that important. It's definitely important. So let's go ahead and make our little roundabout over here. We can even have another stop somewhere along the way over here, honestly. Because, it's, you know, it's a little bit far. So let's go ahead and maybe have a stop somewhere in here. So let's see. Looks like there's an open area right there, so we're going to do that. And this is a little bit weird, but you know what? This is fine. You do doop do doop curved right sure that works for me so now we have to connect all the way over here somehow before this because you know it has to stop there naturally so let's see we're gonna go ahead and bring this out through here curve it over here we can actually um we can probably add another metro stop to the corner over here in the residential area just because we probably need this. And I know this is looking a little bit wonky, but that's just the way it is. Let's go ahead and add the metro stop over here. You know, both buses come through here. You know what? It's okay. <laughs> it's definitely okay. Eesh, that's going to add a lot of sound. Well, we can add it over here instead, and that should be okay. Although it's uh, a little bit weird because we're going to have to add this in a different way. I'm okay with this. So we're going to go ahead and curve this. Like, uh, let's go for here. I'm trying to curve this into... Oh, we could just go right into that. Sure! works for me and now geez after so much work here trying to get this to come all the way over here we are going to try to curve this guy all the way through let's see over here sure sure so as for our lines we are going to have to expand this line we're going to add a stop over here add a stop over excuse me add a stop over here and is that going to go all the way it works it works. It doesn't use this area anymore, but it works. So, I guess that means we can probably delete this. <laughs> we can probably delete this if we're careful, but I, I guess I can just leave the infrastructure there in case we ever need it ever again. But, yeah, look at that. Now we have a brand new uh, area here for, well, n new stops, I should say. So that way we can transport more people instead of having them ride the freaking cars all through this area where we want to clean up the road, okay? We have a lot of oil trucks which is not good. And ore trucks, my gosh. No wonder we're all stuffed up here. I wonder why they're not... Are they... These companies, like, somewhere over here? Really? You couldn't take this one? Really? Uh, some of these guys. I, I don't know what I'm going to do with them because clearly they're causing more traffic than needs to be there. But this area is not as bad as it once was. It's definitely better. This area, however, is... is Pretty bad. I think I want to make another connection instead of going through this. I want to make the connection through here. That way we have a road free and clear of housing that we could just take straight through because this is a little bit of a problem that's clearly creating even more problems than what we need here. But that's not our worst situation right now. That is just not. This area seems to be okay, although we're having some red there because of course cars have to turn around. That's, you know, it's fine with me, whatever. It's not the worst thing. Jeez. It looks like we are going to need a turnaround area here because them turning around creates a little bit of traffic, which is not okay. And we do need some workers there, unfortunately, so we might have to create another bus line to go from here to all the way down there. Or eventually, maybe we can get a train, just because that's probably going to be a little bit easier to do. Especially since we have a train, like, right over there, so yeah, that's probably going to be easier to do. And what what's happening here? Facility full. Um, that's not a landfill. It is a cemetery. All right, fair enough. So we're going to empty this out just so we can clear that out. That is taking a big area we can use for other things. So fair enough. Right, so traffic. Clearly, our biggest traffic issue is right over here. People are, of course, trying to go all the way through so they can get through to here. And this is causing a ton of problems. So we need to create different ways of getting to this area. Now, I did make one before. It caused a lot of problems. Yeesh. So let's see. What can we do to actually make this viable? We do have this road over here that's basically not being used. I think that's what we're going to go with. I think that's exactly what we're going to have to go with. Just because nothing else will work. 
So let's see, one way highway with sound barriers. Perfect. So let's go ahead and expand this out to, let's see, down here. Can we connect it up like that? We can, and we'll delete one business. I'm okay with this. So it's going to be our exit right there. It's a little bit uh, bridgy. What? That's not really what I wanted, but okay, game. And now we're going to have people coming on this way. Nobody can actually get on the highway here, which... Hmm. How do I feel about this? I don't like it, actually. Two-lane highway. Wait, do we have other roads here that we can use? Four-lane highway uh, with some barriers. Mm, in one direction. I want it going two directions. I want it something like... Uh, not that one. Two-way highway. There we go. Something like that. But unfortunately, it seems like there are only one lane two-lane highways. Because these are both... You know what? I'm just going to try it. I'm going to try it. If it works, it works. If not, then... I will definitely change it just because we're going to need more room here. So hopefully this works. If not, then, well... Yeesh. All right, and it looks like we're having other issues over here as well because this area that we built in... Let's see. Yeah, over here. <laughs> we're having some issues trying to get onto here, but that's causing some traffic over here. But for the most part, it seems like these on and off ramps are kind of okay the way they are. So that works for me. Having maybe the off ramp over here probably connecting to this might also be okay because that's going to clear up some area here so let's try that and see if it works for us so we're going to go for the two-lane highway uh, this one here we're gonna go for this one and let's see we want to expand it out to something over i guess here if we put it there we're gonna have people driving through the residential area and that's not gonna be nice they're gonna be pretty mad about that so let's see you want to go ahead and start spacing this out a little bit more Sure, right here. So we're going to go ahead and expand this out to over here. And let's see, can we actually curve this a little bit? Space already occupied. Space already... Uh, excuse me? Oh, that works. Can I come to the here? Because that's kind of nice. <laughs> that's kind of a nice way it is. Sure, it looks like I can. So let's try that. And that should help because I, I feel like a lot of the traffic is honestly trying to come up into that area. And clearly that's what we need to just... That's where we need to go to. This whole intersection is all messed up and weird looking, but if it works, it works. That's all we need right now. We just need something that's functional. Not exactly anything that looks nice, okay? Also, we're losing quite a lot of people, so it seems like we're needing to do something more to take care of our needs here. So let's see, what are people complaining about? Party all night, have you lost your wallet? Uh, scientists working day and night on Gek. We are close to breakthrough. Okay, that's... Not really what I was thinking about, but sure. And we have absolutely nobody visiting these areas, unfortunately. Well, I guess that's fine. I mean, you know, we did that just to make it look nicer in this area. So people would be like, hey, that's a pretty nice place. And we already have these at level 3, so I guess they're fine. Just the way they are. Oh, are they solar powered or are those windows? I'm going to assume those are just windows. Never mind. Uh, and yeah, you are ooh, brand new building just because maybe the other one's left. That's not so good. How are we doing in terms of residential? It seems like we're slowly building in here, so we are getting some people. But overall, it's not as many people as we need. Are there a lot of old people? There are a lot of old people. Aha! So we are about to get a big onslaught of death. And crime rate is high over here. Or do we have police? We do have police. They're just not visiting you for some reason. We're, they're right here. They should be able to get there pretty easily, too. They're just being lazy. Wow, I can't believe this. I cannot believe my eyes. Well, that's... It's, it's whatever. You know what? That's not our concern right now. Our concern is mostly traffic. So, are we getting cars coming through here? We are. And they're definitely, you know, just... It's not that much. It's not big traffic. So, I guess this is okay. Again, even though it looks fugly, it's okay. So, that's... That's okay with me. However, we are, of course, still getting a lot of traffic here, which I am not okay with. Let's see, where are these guys going? Where are you going? Returning to facility? Where is the facility? I can't even tell. You are driving out of the city. Fair enough. Fair enough. Although, you probably should have left somehow else. I don't know. Exporting goods. Returning to facility. That's the problem. It seems like a lot of people are just straight up leaving. So, you are driving home. So, you live... All the way over there. And you are stuck in this traffic here. Yeah. I think that you can probably do a better job of getting home if you take this road over here. Let's see. Is this working? This is working. It looks like it's pretty clear. And there's just not that many people. We can get off and on if we need to. That way we don't have so many cars driving through here. So I think that was definitely a pretty good change. However, it seems like we're still not getting enough deliveries here. So how's our power situation? 
It's okay, so maybe it might be good to start getting rid of these pretty soon. Oh, we just had something delivered there, so that's good. We are getting the oil delivered. Is that the truck there? It was. Nice. So it refilled one. That's it. Well, I guess it's okay. We will get rid of these pretty soon, though, because, you know, green energy is the way to go, and that makes people pretty happy, too. We are having a little bit of an issue over here with the crime rate being high. Do we have police? They're right there, so they're just being lazy again. That's... jeez. Well, whatever. I guess we should... Do we have another one of these? Detained criminals. I like how we have so many criminals. We should make a prison, but I kind of want to make a prison, like, on a mountain, and I think there's a mountain somewhere over here. Yeah, like, over here. So if we ever get this area, I kind of want to build a prison there, because I think that's going to be really cool. Or, you know, we can always just build it, like, somewhere in the water and be another Alcatraz, because that's clearly going to be so cool. Oh, my gosh. I was being a little bit facetious there. My, my apologies. And what do we have here? We have an intelligence... Ooh, wait, what? We don't have this. This government building gathers information and forces mass surveillance throughout your region. With an ever-growing need for high-profile security measures, your city can now task the Central Police Intelligence Agency with public... Oh! Well, this is definitely made for something, like, in here, and it looks like it's never gonna fit in these streets, unfortunately, so we're gonna have to, like, dump this somewhere else, like, on the corners, which I'm okay with. It doesn't fit there at all. Like, it's... I mean, it fits there, like, actually, but thing if it's just it doesn't fit properly so I don't want to put it there do we have anything over here of course we have disaster response units but we've yet to actually see a disaster so I'm just gonna you know not build that crypto oh what is this cryo preservatory this controversial building stores a clinically deceased oh oh this could be good especially since we have so many dead people and a medical laboratory Hmm, this sounds like something I should be placing near this area over here, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Let's see, place it somewhere over... Jeez, that's gonna take up a lot of room. This is okay, though, because I kind of want it in here. So let's go ahead and drop that in there, and this is not gonna go there. We want this to go somewhere over here, because we have just a lot of dying people, and we always... We just want to try to preserve them if, you know, they want to be preserved. Let's not put a street there, because that's gonna cause some trouble, some problems. Let's not put this there, I should say. So, uh, there's stuff everywhere here, because clearly... I mean, we could probably just put it there, even though there's other things around there. Hmm. There's really no room for this, is there? I mean, we, this area is pretty clear of everything, so I guess I could just drop it, like, right there. Space or excuse me? Ah, there's a taxi stop there. Gotcha. I was like, what exactly is stopping me from doing this? Well, I could delete all this stuff, but I really don't want to. Fine, I'll just put it right over here, right next to the park, because that's not morbid at all. Never mind, I'm not going to do that there. Let's just put this guy right over here, sure. Because I would like to see how that building operates. So what do we have here? We have the sea steward, we have hearses. Nice, so we could probably get rid of something. Oh, it's already going out to actually get some dead people. Wonderful! Ooh, look at these. These look nice. I actually really like this look. Nice! Also, I, I, I like this look more, though, because... Uh, it's just more refined and kind of nice, so I like that one more, and I want them all to be like that. I wish. If only. If only, you guys. Alright, so it's looking like we're having some kind of water issue over here. This is definitely solvable by bringing this up through here and connecting it with this guy right to there. That's no big deal at all. And what else are we having here? We are not apparently getting enough business here because... Why? Is that filled in? That is filled in. Well, see, we do have enough commercial area, so... Right now, they should be actually building up here. I don't know why they're not, but they're just not. Hmm. Well, this kitty cat cafe. <gasps> no way! Kitty cat cafe! Nice! Although, you can't really see where the cat cafe is, but whatever. Okay, so let's see. Traffic, traffic. We are trying to solve the traffic issue. Ooh! Okay, so this isn't as red as it was before. It seems like the traffic is flowing a little bit better. However, we clearly still have issues. <laughs> so even though we tried to clean it up, it wasn't good enough. And, oh, we are definitely having problems with power now. Mm -hmm. So we have this not powered. What else do we have? We have nuclear power. Um, high water usage does not create ground pollution. This one doesn't create ground pollution either, right? Do, 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 640. This is... A big difference although this is so much more expensive and it's gonna create a ton of noise so of course well, we can have it here I don't want to hear though <laughs> I really don't want to hear this is the area for this kind of stuff just because sloped is too steep are you kidding me just because I figure you know what this is basically our industrial a second industrial area so sure all right so that should be more than enough power come on now 
Is that going to work? There we go. So, nuclear power, huh? We are definitely getting into the atomic area here. Is anybody else thinking that? Amazing vacation. Uh, let's see. Hello, 21st, 21st? 25th century. I'm glad the mayor is brave enough to consider nuclear power as a valid option for electricity. Going nuclear. Yes, sirree. We are that brave because apparently, you know what? Building nuclear is a brave thing to do. What? Whatever. You know what? We were just trying to do what's efficient for us because... We just need that, and let's see, are we gonna connect this anywhere through here? Can we please? Apparently not. Oh, there we go, over there. Sure. That should cover most of that road. Not this little spot right there, but you know what? We're not putting anything there just yet, so that's okay. And are we good? We are good in terms of power, in terms of water now. Good, good, good. And it's just looking like these guys are still actually without power. Did we disconnect something? I'm gonna guess that that's a yes, somehow. Let's see. This is still connected over here. Wait, that's, not, that's not a yes at all. This is still connected over there. This is still connected over there. What? Are we actually connected to the rest of the power grid? No, we're not. That would make some sense as to why that didn't work. Okay, we're gonna have to move this guy. Eesh. Oof. Okay, so we're gonna move this guy right over here. Yeah, it's fine there, I guess. And <laughs> that should be connected to the rest of the grid now. So you guys... You're fine. You're totally fine. Multiple problems. You know what? The electricity problem should be going away any second now. Are we actually... Is that activated? Operating normally. Uh-huh. Excuse me? Ex what? Am I missing something here, you guys? Like, is this not connected with the rest of this? It looks like it is. But apparently those guys need more power. Do you guys want this right next to you? Because, you know, it's actually really, really loud and... You're not going to be happy if I put this right next door. Y you guys sure? You guys sure? Oh yeah, it's looking like we're actually having rolling blackouts over there. Okay, so we're not going to drop another one of these because that's just way too expensive. We're going to try to actually fix up uh, what problems we're having with... Let's see, let's connect this guy somewhere over here. These should be connected with this over here. So we're going to have to just... Uh, can we page up the whole thing? Can we actually get this across? Oh, it looks like really, really close there. Yes, we can. Okay, that works for me. So, let's see. Can we actually... What? Wow, that's a waste. <laughs> Whatever, we're getting this through and there it goes. Okay, so now it's connected with that. Please, please work. I don't know why... Okay, so we did get rid of a connection somewhere. Not 100% sure where, but you know what? We fixed it, so I am okay with this. And for some reason, these are still connected, even though the other ones weren't. Hmm... Just slightly sketchy. Alright, so how is this area building up? It's looking quite nice, honestly. These houses are massive, though. Look at that. Well, I guess it's okay. Police station right there. That's actually quite nice there. I kind of like that. I don't know about you guys, but I kind of like the way this is actually turning out. So, we solved a little bit of our traffic issue in this episode. And now this whole road isn't looking as bad. It's just, it seems like it's this exit. So, traveling from one... Highway to the other is definitely a big problem. So we might have to create another exit for it somewhere along the way. Let's see. Where? <laughs> Where exactly are we going to create another exit for this? I mean, if these people are going to this area, we could probably just take another exit through here and connect it somewhere up here and maybe try to get them out a little bit faster. But that's going to create more problems. As you can see, there's already some issues there, which we are going to have to take care of because, of course, it's going to take forever to transport people and that means that we're going to have dead people just infecting basically everybody. And that's not what we need at all. But we'll take care of that in the next episode. Because that is it for this episode of City Skylines Mass Transit. If you enjoyed, hit that like button to show your support. And subscribe if you already haven't. But anyways, always, thank you so much for watching. And have... In awesome night.